The final frontier, the drums are beating, let loose the dogs of war. The hounds are out, the hunt is up, and the flag-waving patriots are waxing their cars. Happy days and burning flesh. The front gardens are in full bloom with the scent of blood and steel. Many tongues all dancing to the same tune, a seductive one. A barnstorming, floor-storming, shit-kicking tune. Torn out of thin air and run up a flagpole. Lined with painted faces, cheering insanely, dancing to her tune. The air is filled with blowing bubbles, fantasy worlds floating in a dream. In a dream, patriotic dream, dancing in a dream. The simplistic jingle whiskey. Have you seen the hokey cokey woman Winging that handbag with the madness in her eyes Leading the way to one big happy family Everyone's a big man, he's up in the east And Britannia's gonna rule the waves again Lined with darkness, crippled shadows stumble to her tune. There was filled with nightmare visions, first illusions, the remnants of a dream. Oh, that dream, patriotic dream, dancing in a dream. The centralistic jingle is day. Have you seen the hokey cokey woman? Swinging that handbag with the madness in her eyes Leading the way to one big happy family Everyone's a big ten, he's up in the east And Britannia's gonna rule the waves again She frightens me, the hokey cokey woman. She gives me nightmares. I'm on a tube train in the middle of London. Translucent skin, waxworks. The train rattles along with mindless efficiency, and so do we. It stops in the middle of a tunnel. A black hole, silence. We slowly become aware of a great weight overhead and not much air to go around. There is the stirring of life, the rustle of a newspaper, the tapping of a foot, a nervous cough, the startled lifting of a head as the first whiff of panic drifts downwind. The wax is melting. As civilization crumbles, the cracks spread across the stone facades. The woman sitting opposite me is applying her lipstick, slashing it across her forehead and cheeks. The man sitting next to her is getting frantic, tearing at the buttons of his shirt. His head explodes, covering us in gore. There's a Greek island. An eyeball sunbathing, a dictaphone covered in blood. Hideous shapes come crawling from the unplumbed depths of human nightmares. Everyone is losing control when a familiar voice is heard from the end of the carriage. You put your left leg in, your left leg out. It's the hokey cokey woman. 
In horror of horrors, they all start doing it. And they're closing in on me, kicking out their legs, and their faces are all friendly and smiling like during the blitz. And I'm screaming at them to leave me alone that I don't want to do the bloody hockey cokey. Now they're moving away down into the next carriage. And suddenly I don't want to be left alone with the creatures of the night. And I'm off after them, shouting, wait for me, kicking out my legs as I go. Telephone never rings, the dead springs never sing, silence is deafening to me. Time is no more, it just crawled out of the door, the empty hours were not much company. Telephone never rings, from summer through to spring. Sits there making fun of me A smile upon its face As it watches my disgrace A goldfish and a fly for company On the rug a capsized mug A stagnant pool of tea I'm going round the bend cigarette ends to see where that takes me Telephone never rings just says the same old thing No one is calling out for you No surprises, no thrills I don't know why I pay the bills Just hoping for something out the blue Looking through a keyhole to a life that's out of reach Where the rich have all the fun Instead of on a ski slope or lying on a beach I'm stuck here on the dark side of the sun I'm stuck here on the dark side of the sun The bright red telephone squatting in a corner, a poisoned toad. Its useless umbilical cord connected to nothing. A red-faced Santa with an empty sack, feeding me silence with cheerful indifference. Ring your bell, my perfidious friends. Bring out the dead, bring out the dead. The cigarette burns sweat-stained sheet A sand-coloured floor A beach scene Follow the footsteps going out the door A desert scene Deserted by the sea A lunar landscape waiting on a flag Stick one in and watch me bleed Slipping and sliding over the edge, hanging on by fingernails that are chewed to the bone. The babbling tongues have all stood still, the listening ears have turned away. All that remains is insidious grunting from my neighbor's boudoir. Be still, my beating heart, you take my breath away. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You have scorched my flesh and bleached my bones and cast me up upon this foreign shore to lie amongst the flotsam and the jetsam. Ground control. 
Here in my tin can, I cannot understand, I cannot understand space. Why she needs so much of it? When there is so much to go around. I mean, why shouldn't you talk to yourself, though? I mean, even by the laws of recognised science, we are a different person from one day to the next. So why shouldn't you have a conversation with the face in the mirror? Find out who you have the pleasure of spending the next 24 hours with. Good manners cost nothing. And there's nothing to be lost in an exchange of different points of view. I mean, where would we be without the ability to see both sides of the coin? All tail and no heads. Some people will say that half a pantomime horse is better than nothing. I say you have to give the punters their money's worth. So how's it going, me old mate? Me old mucker? Me old fly by night boy, me old Donald and Ducker? How's she cutting? How's she hanging from the yard arm? I'm all right, Jack. Ooh, it's Jack, is it? And what manner of Jack would that be exactly? Jolly Jack Tar, har, har, har. Jack the lad, Cakewalk Incorporated, the talk of the town, start spreading the news, Jack is back. Jack of all trades. Boring, boring old butcher Jack. Jack the baker, and every pie a finger. The useless, undependable Jack which breaks down and leaves you stranded with a flat tyre in the middle of nowhere and the locals bearing down on you waving pitchforks. Jack the Ripper. Jack the Stripper. Springing from his lunchbox with a nod and a wink to the girls. Jack the Tripper. Climbing up his own beanstalk. Too spaced out to disembowel anybody. Jack, my man, you so crazy. Uh, there we are, as long as we can have a laugh, eh? So why the long face then? Ah, uh, yes. Jack without his jewel. Carrying his lonely bucket up and down the hill. Rosie, Rosie. My, my nemesis. nemesis. My, my bet, bet noir. noir. Are you talking to me? Who are you? I really want to know. Who? Such a little word. Such big connotations. The fat wee double you. A broken down accordion squeezing out desperate laments. The towering H, reaching for the sky, full of hopes and dreams. The round little pot-bellied O, that leaves you gasping with surprise as it swallows you whole. I only feel right on my knees, spill out like a sewer hole. Your words are like poisoned rats, running to the den of their own iniquities. And your pied piping has led me to the gates of hell, time and time again. Time, the snowman, melting in the bath. I can see you in the waiting room. The pair of you charging along an express train of Leviticus and filth. No holds are barred 
No stone left unturned, no pasture left unplowed. The walls are smeared with the excrement of your lust in that ghostly, ghastly hell hole. Time, the eternal, infernal triangle. Time is dead. Nothing's dead. Time is the past and the past is dead. Nothing's dead until the hatchet's buried. And some of us still have an axe to grind, a monkey on our back, a bone to pick and chew over. I have a train to catch. All change. All change. Goodbye. of my past Wrap my arms around my body Pull it gasping in the air Spilling out my contradictions Spitting out my fears In the mirror Always thinner In my eyes The lights grow dimmer Watch myself Fade away With your head upon my shoulders Together we could so to say But surely there has to be more to life than this the goldfish, the sweat-stained sheet, the staring competitions with the fly. I mean, all very exciting as it is. There's a whole metropolis of new and interesting people out there. So what keeps me trapped within these four walls? Apart from a dead cat, of course. I suppose fear, really. It's fear of talking to strangers in case they think I'm some kind of nut. Fear that I am some kind of nut. Or I'm not nuts enough. And I'm just a kind of middle of the road, average, sat in the fence, not very interesting, dull, unattractive personality. I practice my smile in the mirror. Fear of strangers talking to me in case they turn out to be some kind of nut. Make demands, attach strings and land my doorstep at two o'clock in the morning, a flood of tears and throw a brick through my window and I won't let them in. Fear of opening my mouth and having nothing to say. Or fear of opening my mouth and putting my foot in it and getting invited outside by some character with huge shoulders and no neck and a bullet-shaped head. 
fear of eating out alone in case the waiters treat me with contempt, fear of going to the cinema alone, especially if the film has the faintest hint of erotic content, pervert, pervert. Fear of sitting or was standing alone in the pub, because I think everybody must be looking at me surreptitiously and thinking, God, I'm glad I'm not him. He must be a really sad, lonely bastard. So you feel the sweat gathering offensively in your armpits and people start to move away and finally leave altogether in search of a pub that doesn't have a lonely, sweaty bastard in it. <laughs> of damp approaching as you pass no black hole as a goldfish goes round your head is swimming in her bowl you need to get a life you need to get a laugh you need to get beyond the dead cat lying on your path I'm waiting on the ecstasy I'm waiting on the fantasy I'm waiting on the clouds apart shed a little light on me waiting on the cart to pop waiting on the bells to ring I'm waiting on the kiss of the chicken king from the war beating on the streets outside your walls flag waving patriots are setting out their stalls you're counting out the minutes as they crawl across the floor just waiting on the neighbors to come kicking in your door you need to get a life you need to get a laugh You need to get beyond the dead cat lying on your path I'm waiting on the ecstasy I'm waiting on the fantasy I'm waiting on the cloud to part And shed a little light on me Waiting on the cart to pop Waiting on the bells to ring I'm waiting on the kiss of the chicken king I'm waiting on the ecstasy I'm waiting on the fantasy Waiting on the clouds to part And shed a little light on me Waiting on the cart to pop Waiting on the bells to ring And waiting on the kiss Of the chicken king Chair, staring at the wall The fly upon the light bulb Is witness to your fall The patch of damp approaching Is your personal black hole As the goldfish goes round Your head is swimming in her bowl You need to get a life You need to get a laugh You need to get beyond the dead cat Lying on your path I'm waiting on the ecstasy, I'm waiting on the fantasy I'm waiting on the clouds to part and shed a little light on me I'm waiting on the cart to pop, waiting on the bells to ring I'm waiting on the kiss of the chicken king